what it is, Bross and Haas. My name is Daniel. That is why I'm here, and this is made for fishing. So today, I'm pouring Bango Tigers. That's right, Bango Tigers. So you see the front and the back. So you got some orange, you got some pearl white, and you got some black. But I'm going crazy. We're using core shot Senko worms. The, the mold is a core shot Senko. And we're going tiger orange on the top. We're going black on the bottom. And then I'm striping it with white. So come along. Let's have some fun. Let's make some bait. Let's get to it. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour uh, a laminate, obviously. We're gonna make two colors, one out of straight up black and one with fire tiger orange. And what happens is when you laminate, you're gonna get one color on the bottom and one on the top. And it's gonna pour around the core shot and you're going to be left with a hole that goes right through the entire middle of the bait. So I'm going to have orange and black, and then I'm going to pull the baits off of the sprue and leave the cores on. And I'm going to cut holes for the stripes with the core still on so that I can make them uniform, only in the yellow part. And then I'm going to re-pour, I'm going to pull the the core's out, I'm going to re-pour and I'm going to get white stripes and a white core. Alright, let's mix some colors. Let's go black. Plenty of black, I want it black. Beautiful. All right, we'll be back to pour in just a second. So like I said before, if you've been watching my videos, I always salt right before I pour just so that the salt doesn't go all the way to the bottom. As you can see, see looks what, that's what happens is the salt just sinks. And creates a bunch of bubbles and ruins the plastic. And don't think I don't know, it's not bangle tiger. I call it bango just as a play on words because when the fish bite, they go bango. So the orientation of the bait doesn't matter because it's round. They suggest that you pour super fast. and hold pressure. <coughs> All right. We'll see how that turns out. All right, so time for the big reveal. I've already opened one, Sneaky Pete. All 
Oh, they flashed super bad. Look at that. See, that's what happens when you push too hard. This comes out of the bait and it flashes them all together. But it comes right off. It just makes it a little more labor intensive. You gotta pull all of that stuff off. It just comes right off, you see. Easy stuff. But, so that's the black side and then the orange side with the black flake. So, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the sprues off. Leaving the rods in place. And then we're gonna cut holes, cut stripes in the orange, and then we're gonna pour macro pearl after we pull the rods out and it's gonna fill the stripes all right so let me show you what I'm doing here so essentially like I said before this rod stays in while I use an exacto knife right an exacto knife to cut little channels to make the stripes so I leave the rod in so that I can get a gauge on how deep to cut on the exacto hopefully you'll be able to see this so I'm just gonna cut one for you it's pretty tedious actually but it's kind of fun easy right so now when I pour the white in, it's gonna go through the bait and fill all of these channels. In theory, <laughs> it's gonna fill all of these channels and go all the way through the tail. And so here I've got some more. I made a couple of crazy diamonds. I mean a diamond, so diamond head, diamond middle, straight back, just random. I didn't wanna just do a bunch of channels to make them all straight, so. Um, yeah, so I'm going to pull the, the rods out, set them back inside the bait. I'll be right back to show you the white color that I'm doing. Okay, back again. So we got this heated up. And we're using this beautiful stuff. You can see that. It's just a little bit shinier than micro pearl. just a minute to pour the trick to this pouring the core shots especially the core of the core shot is to get this the core smoking hot um, you don't want to burn it obviously anything over 400 degrees you're burnt but 350 to 370 seems to be the ticket All right. Well, there you go. We'll be back in just a minute for the big reveal. Back again, and here we go. We'll see. Come on, baby. Bango! 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 Oh, baby. And you see, that is awesome. Oh, sweet bango tigers. Yeah, see this is, I didn't, uh, I didn't show you any of these, but yeah, that's 
that's cool. I call them Bango Tigers, but they kind of look like a snake. Can you name the snake in the comments below? So this one. Oh yeah, see I cut, I just cut the tail off of this one. It's got a little dimple, but mm-hmm, bass are stupid. They'll never tell. Oh yeah, see that one even got a little line down the middle. Awesome. Okay. Yeah, now you know what time it is, right? Time for the bathtub test. No, I don't want to get wet. You're getting wet, dude. I don't want to. You need a bath. Please don't. Bath time. That's a big one, dude. <laughs> yeah.